Hello everyone, and this is Reggie with Stock Talk, right? And so I wanna give an update on Apple. If you looked at my previous video, I said Apple is due to for a breakout. Um, it was respecting this flag pattern here. Zoom out a little bit so we can see it. You can see this blue line and I have these, these yellow lines too. I look at the lower yellow line, that's a flag pattern. It has broken out of the flag pattern. So if you purchase, uh, so this is around that video is around the beginning of December. So uh, if you purchased Apple, congratulations! I'm sure you, you've made a lot of money right now. And but the breakout still hasn't the big breakout still hasn't happened yet. But it's been moving up, 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 up and up. So it has broken out of the flag pattern. Uh, today we're seeing um, a huge, huge spike up in price. Uh, we 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 went from as low, we had a low of 124, um, and so we spiked up. We're up to 126, and still moving to the, to the upside. Volume has come in. Look like we're breaking out now. Uh, we also have the MACD pivoted towards upside, and our RSI is also supporting it. We had a cross in RSI, so right now we actually are experiencing a gap up, and look like we're going to hit our head. Uh, around 127 it may get to 130 it may even get as high as this uh trend line here which is about one 129 uh so we, we we should we may hit 129 today uh or sometime during the week so we are experiencing a breakout right now of apple just like i predicted uh based off of technical analysis using that bull flag pattern that it developed the bull flag is when it you see higher lows and lower highs is consolidating consolidating and then the, the pent-up demand it just explodes out um volume is what helps that along right now we're even i mean we're about 30 minutes to the trading day and we've already almost at half of the volume we had yesterday um and we've been at if you look at look where my cursor is the this red line here is the average volume so we've been just hitting the average volume uh, if we keep pace on where we're at uh, as of today we should break out past all the average volume so apple is a breakout stock right as of right now let's confirm that with the four hour chart the four hour chart shows uptrend according to the sar indicator uh we have a huge candlestick also the four hour chart shows a crossover of the MACD into the upward territory. And RSI is also confirming upward movement. So look like a breakout day for Apple. Um, trade according to your strategy. Don't you know, choose pick and choose your entry points. Uh, it will pull back at some point. What goes up comes down, but it doesn't matter how much it comes down and when it comes down. Um, all of our indicators one hour two hour everything shows uptrend huge spike in apple five minute is showing okay we're showing a bit of retracement here um that is possibly a reversal but i mean it still hasn't not i'm gonna call it a full reversal but it's so far outside to make the uh bollinger band it has to consolidate at some point and come back inside. Um, and that, that's a five minute. So five minutes isn't, unless you're day trading, isn't much to go on. It's good for entry points. So keep an eye on that. We'll keep an eye on Apple. Uh, we are at a breakout as of right now. It's still early though. It's, it's morning trading and morning trading is the wild, wild west. So this can easily come all the way back down uh, to the 123. But our support definitely is going to be for today at 123.13. So we shouldn't get no lower than 123. We're up $3 as of right now. So just keep an eye on Apple for today. If you're looking for an entry point, um, Apple is, as predicted, starting to break out. And our support, you know, let me delete all these lines. Do fresh support. So our support line is 125. 
So when it comes back down, it should come back down to 125. And hopefully it holds that support um, to verify the breakout of this flag pattern. So keep on Apple. This is Regiment Stock Talk. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you can constantly get notifications of breaking news or breaking breakouts <laughs> such as Apple. But keep in mind, this is the morning session. The morning session is the wild, wild west, high volatility. It can easily, I mean, it could drop down to $100. You never know with morning session. So uh, let's keep watching the stock. Uh, maybe make a move after 12, after 1 p.m. Uh, just keep watching it because um, we are at the top of this Bollinger Band. So that kind of limits, that kind of gives it a ceiling. So right now, 120, probably 127 is our ceiling based off what I see here. Um, but that Bollinger Band can reset and move, and it can, it can push past the Bollinger Band uh, with the right amount of volume. And we are getting good volume right as of right now. So um, we do have um, the MACD is confirming an uptrend, and our RSI is confirming an uptrend on our daily chart. So uh, things are looking good for Apple. This is Reggie with Stock Talk. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you can constantly get reminders and also. Um, up, keep updated on the stocks that we're trading. Also, as I'm talking, I see another trend line that could be drawn for support. About right there. Okay. Yeah, if it does crash, it'll crash down to 119. But we've got a lot of good volume. So, I mean, you want to look at both sides, you know, look at the where it's going, look at what it could be on a, on a downturn. You never know. It's not really moving on much news. Uh, we got some news about them producing 30% more iPhones uh, forecasting. Oops. So that's where we're at on Apple. Kind of lost my page there. Uh, that's where we're at on Apple. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments. If you have a stock you want me to look at from a technical analysis point of view or just get my opinion on, uh, feel free to leave it in the comments. This is Reggie with Stock Talk. We'll see you in the next video.